Hi there. So we don't seem to do too many FJ60s these days. Got to tell you, I love them, but they're not aging very gracefully. So the FJ62s, I think we do a lot more traffic in, but occasionally we'll come across a 60. That's the exception, and here is one of those. So we've actually been responsible for servicing this truck for about the last uh, five or six years. Uh, it's always been a Southern California truck. Uh, it's all original, and as you can tell, it's just been really well cared for. So specific histories with us would include uh, starting in, uh, well, my system, my old system I didn't dig up. So just starting at 2009, I can confirm. We restuffed the driver's seat and repaired the outer bolster. We did a valve adjustment. We replaced the radiator and many hoses. Then, trivial, but in August of 2010, we replaced the rear bumper because it had a ding in it. And then, 10 of 2010, when the truck had 175,000 miles on it, it had developed a rod knock, so we did a complete rebuild and balance of the factory long block, uh, as every time we do those full rebuilds. We approach it pretty comprehensively. So that was rebuilt and balanced internally. That was all new hoses and clamps and belts and PCV valve and water pump. We upgraded the EGR J tube to the TLC stainless steel version and we replaced the clutch assembly and resurfaced the flywheel. Uh, then again, February of 2012, we did another valve adjustment. We rebuilt the steering box. We replaced the temperature gauge, rear brake wheel cylinders and shoes, serviced the battery, upgraded the terminals to the marine. Uh, brass ones. And then um, September of that same year we replaced the EGR valve and then March of 2013 we replaced the fan clutch and the side marker lights. Other than that oil changes and stuff like that. Um, truck is as you can tell visually in just remarkable condition. It runs and drives quite properly as well. Uh, no odd vibrations, noises, or funk. It has been repainted. There's no evidence of any rust repair or accident history. I imagine it was just getting chalky like they normally do. When the truck was repainted, the client upgraded the rear view mirrors to these Australian spec 60 series mirrors, which are way better, much better visibility than the US spec. This truck is a 1986. It has 190,000 miles and change on it currently. Uh, all upholstery, carpet, headliner, all of that's all original. There's uh, some minor wear, it's not really wear so much as a scuff on the uh, headliner. Uh, I'll give a shot at cleaning it. This truck is so well pampered that uh, I didn't even detail it. I just hopped in it after buying it and jumped in it and ran off to do this shoot. But uh, I'll be cleaning it up and I'll take a look if we can improve that headliner issue, but I doubt it. Other than that, my only complaint with the truck's the stereo. The stereo sucks. It's Blaupunk's best from the 1980s, so uh, you probably want to redo that. Otherwise, on the interior, there's no cracks on the dash. All weather stripping is quite supple. All the upholstery is in really exceptional shape, and uh, it's dead stock down to the original jack and toolbox, and, or rather tool bag. One groovy thing are these shifters. Check this out. Someone took the time to turn these out of hardwood, and, and they're all handmade. They're kind of cool. So, um, gosh, I don't know what else to tell you. Um, so I'll just let the video play out. Uh, as always, you know, we ship internationally. Um, so feel free to reach out. And if you have any questions about logistics or costs, happy to address. Truck just passed California smog test with flying colors which is really rare for an FJ60. Usually you're back and forth and fine tuning and retesting. So again, that's another testament uh, to the conditions of this truck. Um, it's, it's really quite nice. So any questions, give me or Jay Myers, my service manager at TLC, a call at 818-280-3330. Otherwise, uh, more information and photos on our website at tlc4x4.com. 
And thanks again for taking the time to uh, support my brand and watch my videos. See ya.